at these beautiful flowers. There's a plant. It's a bush. Some birds. Welcome to Hollywood Studios at the Walt Disney World Resort. It's a it's an interesting morning. It's a little chilly, but it's gonna warm up today. Actually, you can see Gertie over there. She's got smoke coming out of her nose. Man, look at it just coming right out of there. What is happening over there? You know, sometimes in, in the morning time, if it's a little cooler out, you're breathing and it's got that smoke just bellowing out like that. I wonder if it's like that. Do you, do you see any? I can't tell. It's probably not. It's probably too warm now. But if I was a dinosaur, I could probably do it. But anyways, today we're gonna have just a, a nice time. We tried to get the Rise of the Resistance boarding pass for the first one. Did not make it. We did not make it. Seven o'clock, hit the button, already full. We got another chance at one o'clock. We'll see what happens. But right now we're still gonna have some Star Wars action because we have a reservation at Oga's Cantina. So we're gonna go in there and you know, see if the droids are there. The ones we're looking for, you know, those ones. So me and JR, we always gotta do this, or every couple of years, we gotta do this picture that we took over here. And you know, one time he was real little, and then he was a little bigger. Now he's almost as big as me. And here's the picture we were talking about, where, you know, the succession of those. 2011, 2018, and 2021. Wow. Man, JR's really growing up. He's gonna be as big as Gertie here before too long. <laughs> There's always a hidden Mickey everywhere, even here on Batuu. That's right, here we are at Olga's Cantina. Not Olga, but Olga's Cantina. I say all the words right all of the time. Trust me. We are in the search, on the search, we're searching for that droid. That's the, that's, that's the droid we were looking for right there. We found him! We found the droid we were looking for. Oh, look at our table. It's glowing with space future stuff. And... Look at that really cool coaster. That's a Banta. Man, look at all those wires up there. Can you imagine putting that up together? Can you imagine that? Nah, me either. We've got the Jedi mind trick, so that should be pretty good. And then Jessica got the, whoop. She got the outer rim, the outer rim there. Oh, and here's what JR got. JR got the Jabba juice. What is that? It's got some, are those eggs in there? Yeah. Where are those from? Man, all the things in here are so cool. Ooh, did you hear that? That was weird. And then there's Jessica's drink that she got, and then my Jedi mind trick. They do look cool. Tell you what, they definitely got cool looking drinks here. Jessica got the outer rim. It is Patron Silver Tequila with some acai liqueur, lime juice, pure cane sugar with black salt, and exotic fruit, fruit puree. I got the Jedi mind trick. Petal One Botanical Grapefruit and Rose Vodka, John D. Taylor's Velvet Falernum, Bulls Blue Pure Cow, White Grape Juice, Lime Juice, and Grapefruit Bitters. And Jedi Tears. The uh, outer rim is pretty cool. They put a um, black salt rim on it, and then on top is a mango puree. That's really good. And the drink itself is tasty. It's um, really sweet. No, nothing like super fancy. It looks cool, in it, but it tastes really good. Easy to drink. Tequila! Let's see what this Jedi mind trick is all about. It's actually really refreshing. You can really taste the grapefruit in it. Or is that the Jedi Tears? One of the two. It's really good. the sweet beets and sweet treats that we had here. But anyway, as far as this place is concerned, see ya Vader. What? All right, made it out of Oga's Cantina, and I tell you what, bright suns, they're not kidding. It's pretty much the brightest, but man, I think we're gonna just walk around a bit because there's a lot of other people out here in line for a smuggler's run. It's gonna take a while to get through there, and I don't think we have the time. We don't have a time machine. <laughs> but there's Mandalorians. What? Did you see a Mandalorian? I saw a Mandalorian. What? Where? In the DeLorean. Uh, right, and even for Alien Swirling Saucer, we're looking at a 50 minute wait. It might be a difficult day today. It might be a difficult, what do you think? Uh, it's spring break, so I guess we'll see. Oh yeah, spring has sprung. There's old Mickey's Minnie and, oh, Mickey, <laughs> Mickey and Minnie's <laughs> Runaway Railway. Words. Words, there's a lot of line. There's a lot of people all around. It's fairly, it's a busy day. You know what? It always is still incredible, even if there is amazing crowds. I'll tell you what, look at that. Oh, that is amazing. Dang. Woo! <laughs> All right. That 
was great. That was really great. I enjoyed that. The Tower of Terror, I'm sure it's got a decent line, but dang, look at this. The rock and roller coaster standby line is way out here. Way out here down Sunset Boulevard. What in the heck? All right, so we circled all the way back around to Grand Avenue because really there's no rides to ride. So we'll just, we'll just eat a bunch of snacks. So we're in line for Baseline. But as we're in line for Baseline, did you know this, this window here? Look at that. Tacos. I don't think I've ever seen a taco in a window before, but there we go, half now. Check that one off the list. <sighs> All right, <clears throat> made our way over to Baseline Tap House. Finally made it in. Since we can't really get on any rides quickly right now, we decided to go into Baseline and create a little bit of our own excitement with some hefty drinks. Got a, a, a hazy little thing right here, 22 ouncer because it's only like a dollar more than the 16 ouncer. Jessica got her Ace Space Blood Orange. She always gets JR. Huh? What'd you get? Blue Stein Blood Cherry. Nice. Well, we've come back down Sunset Boulevard, and I, I gotta say the crowds aren't that heavy. So we're gonna try our luck on old rock and roller coaster. Get on that. We're gonna wait in line. It says 50 minutes. It's not terrible. It's probably at the maximum that we would want to stop and wait for, but I don't know, we'll give it a shot. But man, look, I think all the crowds are in line for rides instead of out in the streets, so. All right, so we are in line for rock and roller coaster down in the Hollywood Hills area. But there is a point where the line crosses Sunset Boulevard to go over to the other side. It's kind of like the train tracks. Oh look, there we go. There's like our red light, green light. So we got the green light. It's like red light, green light. Uh, have fun. Yeah. <laughs> We're doing it. We're having fun. We don't, you don't have to tell us twice. I don't think that guy was very amused with my red light, green light joke. I wasn't either. <laughs> All right, we're inside G-Force Records getting on, but our time is running pretty tight. Look at that, it's 12.45, which means that pretty soon our second chance, chance to get, to get uh, on to Rise of the Resistance is coming in 15 minutes. Are we going to be able to get on here in time? Let's find out! make it, I think. In the, in the amount of time that we needed to, but we'll find out. We still gotta get out of here so Jessica can get on her phone and do her thing. Let's do this! All right, so it looks like we made it to 12.59. That's before one o'clock. Our special time of possibly getting on a boarding group for Rise of the Resistance. We will see momentarily. We are amped. All right, here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, do it! Go, go, go! Oh. No, 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 no! You're so close. <laughs> well, now what do we do? We leave. Okay, let's go to another park. All right, we dipped in the Hollywood Tower Hotel just to get out of the sun, but hey, don't forget, there is a secret Joffrey's, a second Joffrey's here at Hollywood Studios right by the Tower of Terror. Not only by the entrance to Toy Story Land, there is a Joffrey's over there, but there's also one right over here. There's only two. So if you're looking for a Joffrey's, like that kid, it's just back there. Don't cry. You'll find it. Well, I guess that's it for Hollywood Studios today. We came to do Rise of the Resistance. Didn't make it on the first round. Didn't make it on the second round, but you know what? We made a good day out of it still. We had some good treats. We had some good times. And we saw some neat things. If you ever go to Hollywood Studios and you're like, man, I just gotta do Rise of the Resistance, don't worry, it's okay. There's plenty of other things to do. Hope you enjoyed coming along with us. We'll see you in the next one. As far as we're concerned, yeah. That's pretty cool. Oh,